before ring cameras, before ADT and all that, before any modern home security system, there was a woman named Maria Van Britton Brown, a nurse from Queens, New York. She revolutionized how we protect our homes. Picture this, Queens in the 1960s, crime rates was rising, the police presence and the response time was slow, especially in FBA neighborhoods. Brown worked late shifts as a nurse and her husband Albert worked irregular hours as an electrician technician. This meant they often found themselves home alone at odd hours. That had them feeling vulnerable. Instead of just accepting this situation, Brown did something remarkable. In 1966, she created the first, I quote, the home security camera system, two-way microphone for communicating with visitors, remote control door lock, and a system for viewing visitors on a television monitor. Here's what made her system genius. She mounted a camera that could slide up and down to peer through four peepholes. The camera connected to a monitor in her bedroom. She added a microphone system to talk to visitors, installed a button that could alert police immediately. She created a remote system to unlock the doors. But here's what's fascinating. Look at the phone you have right now. If you have a doorbell camera app, you carrying Marie Van Britten Brown's invention in your pocket. Her patent file in 1966 became the foundation for modern video doorbell systems, two-way audio security features, remote door locking systems, motion sensor activation, and security system monitoring services. What Maria Van Britten Brown created wasn't just a security system. It was a solution to a specific problem facing the FBA community in the 1960s. Here's what most people don't talk about. In Queens, like many urban areas, police response time in FBA neighborhoods could stretch to hours if they came at all. Brown's invention gave FBA families something they desperately needed control over their own safety. The impact was immediate in the community. FBA homeowners could screen visitors before opening the doors. Women living alone felt safer in their homes. Night shift workers could monitor their homes while their families slept. Communities could document suspicious activities. Families could gather evidence of harassment or discrimination. But here's where it gets powerful. The system became more than just security. FBA businesses started installing similar systems. Black churches used the technology to protect against vandalism. Community centers adapted the technology to create safe spaces. It gave FBA families proof when reporting crimes. The technology helped document civil rights violations. The real revolution, for the first time, FBA communities had evidence that could be disputed. Protection that didn't rely on police response. Control over who could access their spaces. A way to protect themselves proactively. Technology that served their specific needs. Maria Van Britten Brown's legacy of self-protection continues even into this day. The spirit of Brown's innovation, it gave FBA communities a way of protecting themselves. 
is more relevant than ever now. Let's look at how her innovation shaped modern society security solutions in our communities. Black owned security companies like RK Security Services and Metropolitan Security Services, they built their foundation off of her. FBA tech entrepreneurs, they creating security apps specifically designed for all community needs. Community alert networks use social media and apps to share security information. Black churches, they using advanced surveillance systems to prevent hate crimes. FBA businesses are combining security with community support. But here's what's really powerful. Modern innovation, they still following Brown's core principles. Peep game. Community controlled security, immediate response time, evident collecting, remote monitoring, proactive protection. Look at these modern examples though. Ring cameras catching racial profiling incidents. Neighborhood watch apps documenting police interactions. Security systems protecting black businesses during civil unrest. Community alert systems warning about suspicious activities. Smart home security protecting FBA families. Brown's innovation isn't just about security cameras anymore. It evolved into a movement of self-reliance. Today, FBA inventors are building off our legacy with things like AI-powered security systems, community-based alert networks, blockchains, verified video evidence, mobile security solutions, integrated community response systems. Marie Van Britten Brown's story isn't just about inventing a security system. It's bigger than that. It's about how one FBA woman saw a problem in her community and created a solution that changed the world. Realize your Mojara FBA power. Think about this. Every time you check your doorbell camera, every time you remotely unlock your door, every time you feel safer inside your house, you're experiencing the legacy of an FBA nurse from Queens who refused to accept vulnerability as her reality. But her legacy goes deeper than technology. She showed us that innovation always, and I repeat myself because I've said this before, innovation comes from necessity. Community protections starts with community innovation. And one thing about foundational black Americans, we're naturally innovative. One person's solution can protect millions. FBA inventors don't just solve problems. They transform industries. Our safety is in our own hands. Today, as we use our smartphones to check our homes, to make sure nothing's going on, that it's safe, nobody's breaking in, as we talk to visitors through our doorbell cameras, as we protect our families with a touch of a button, we're all standing on the shoulders of Marie Van Britten's Brown. She didn't just invent a security system. She invented peace of mind. Just imagine the world without the things she created. From a simple idea in Queens to a global security revolution. Brown's invention reminds us that FBA innovation isn't just about creating new technology. It's about creating a safer, better world for everybody. If this video opened your eyes to something new, 
hit that dis- hit that subscribe button, please, because I got to get my subscribers up, jeez, and hit that notification bell, because I'm 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 doing bad, y'all. I need y'all support, real real talk for the channel. We've got more untold stories. I got more for y'all of FBA inventors who shaped the world. See, as I'm bringing y'all these stories, y'all going to realize foundational black Americans, we created everything we damn near using in this modern day. All this modern tech. Elon Musk wouldn't be nothing without the FBA inventors that came before him. Drop a comment below telling me what everyday inventions you like to hear about next or whatever, you know, great from the past that maybe, you know, I ain't gonna run across, but y'all could put me up on game and, you know, I could shine light on, uh, you know, our FBA ancestors. But until next time, remember, every time you feel secure inside your house, you better thank Marie Van Brick. You better think Marie Van Britain Brown, the FBA inventor who made it possible. We love Marie Van Britain Brown. See you in the next video, FBA fam.